Welcome to the final tutorial of making a snake game in C Sharp. There's not a hell of a lot we're going to do for this last uh, tutorial. Um, pretty much just make a uh, restart method for when the snake dies and um, a score. We'll just add in the score and um, yeah, we'll see how see how it goes. So we'll start off um, in our form one design, and we'll drag on a uh, a status strip, and we'll just drop that in uh, near the bottom, and we will click on it, and it'll come up with a uh, tool strip status label one. Now we want to select the text on that on the right hand side, and just uh, type in score like that, we don't need to name it anything special um, we'll click on the same button again and it will bring out label 2 and for the moment we'll have the text to 0 but we will change the name to be uh, snake score label so we can remember what that label is for um, and We'll just also drag out just a normal label and put it in the middle somewhere and we will um, we'll type in the text there as um, say press space bar to begin cool and we will um, name that space bar label and uh, one final thing we need to do is since we've added the status bar and we need to change the height of the form so um, everything stays in line so we'll make that 350 for the height so yeah it looks, looks about right okay cool so now we can start programming so so coding, so go into form1.cs and um, I think we'll start off by making uh, a new method called public void restart and we will uh, take from the collision um, we'll take from the collision method uh, the, the timer1 dot enable is equal to false and the message box and we'll also um, we will grab the snake score label and we will grab the text from that and we'll make that um, equal to zero so we can just we can just set that to equal to zero as a string, not as an integer. Um, right, and we'll make the space bar label. We'll make that equal to press space bar to begin. Cool. And then finally, we will just um, snake is equal to new snake. initialize that. Now there's one thing we're missing here which is oops, we need to make that um, spacebar label dot text. Sorry. Yeah, one thing we're missing is um, the score, so we'll create that now. So just up the top here we can simply put int score is equal to zero. And um, when we come down down the form more we will be able to find uh, timer one underscore tick and every time that the snake does collide um, with the food we want to add say 10 20 however many points you want um, so we'll put simply put 10 that's just easiest it's plus and equal to 10 and then and up the top of this timer one tick we can also put in snake score label dot text is equal to now we have to convert this 
<coughs> integer to a string so that the label can read it. So I want to convert the score integer into a string like so. So that's done. Um, and um, also just down the bottom here we'll want to make score equal to zero again at the start. So I think that's all we really need from here. So we can take all these out and just put in restart. Um, for these three if statements like that and save that and the last thing we kind of want to do is um, since we said earlier that we want to press the the space bar to get the game started so we'll just do that now so if e dot key data this is in the key down form uh, event I mean um, if e dot key data is equal to keys dot space then uh, time one dot enabled is equal to true and uh, we'll make the spacebar label dot text that can be equal to nothing. So it goes uh, so it goes invisible. And then all we have to do now is down is equal to false. Um, up is equal to false. So whatever direct so we'll make it go right. Right is equal to true and left is equal to false. So now that all that is done, it should um should be ready to go. We set we just need to set the timer to false here, and uh, I think it should be ready to go. So we'll run that. We'll see what happens. So if you try and push on your keys, nothing's going to happen. So press spacebar to begin, and off it goes. And as you can see in the bottom left hand corner of the form, every time the snake hits a piece of food, and there you go, snake is dead. And it should just restart. Press the space bar and off it goes again. Cool. So that's working uh, fantastically. Um, just one other thing I will add in is down the bottom here um, by the message box dot show snake is dead uh, we'll just add in um, you scored and we can just add in your score plus score and that is pretty much it